Well guys, I finally got it. The Fusion DX set. We've got Helios, no, yeah, Helios, Hyperion, and Belial. Helios MR, Hyperion MR. I don't really know what the MR stands for. Yeah, so it turns out that the MR actually stands for metal and rubber. And we got Belial with the new DB core and the ultimate gear. And as you guys can see here, you got the whole descriptions and all that. And all of the how to assemble and whatnot. As well as the three star Beyblades and launcher above. And at the back, you guys can see the fuse gimmick. You can fuse these two. Which is honestly fitting for these two since they're like brothers, so... You know, I'm not gonna lie, when they first came out, I thought that like... The major event would be one of the brothers dying, and then their braid blade breaking, so they fuse into one. And then one of them dyes their, head, their hair like red and blue, and becomes like this new ultimate thing, but... I guess that would be too dark for Beyblade Burst, but... Let's get on with the unboxing. Alright guys, and it's open. So as you guys can see, we got the stickers, the launcher, the red and blue launcher, and behind the stickers, if I could just get the tape off, we have the products. We have Helios MR, Hyperion MR, and Belial Ultimate Gear. So let me just speed through the unboxing real quick. All right, you guys, so we've unboxed it. Here are the stickers and instructions. You guys can see the Hyperion, MR, Helios, Hyperion, and the Ultimate Gear Belial stickers. You've even got the instructions here on how to use the Fuse gimmick. And for the Beyblades, we'll be going in the box order. So first we have Helios MR. At first glance, I'm not gonna lie, he looks pretty cool, but it's previous like evolution. I like the design better, but honestly, if I'm gonna be honest, this thing incorporates all of that, like the intensity and everything. And this part is actually rubber, so if you guys want to know what type of rubber this feels like, go ahead and grab Mirage Fafnir, because that's exactly what this feels like, to me at least. And we even got metal over here too, which is actually really cool. And you got the 10 armor in here as well, and it's BU core. And next you got the traditional Giga Disc, you know. I'm not gonna lie, I mean, eh, it's, it's, it's pretty heavy, but yeah. And then we've got the uh, Giga disc, the Giga driver, I think. Uh, if I got the wrong driver name, I'll probably just edit it in. Yeah, so it wasn't Giga. It's actually called the Zeal driver. Next, we've got Hyperion MR. Once again, really cool looking, like how two brothers face each other. Um, this part is also rubber. Once again, it feels like Mirage Fafnir's rubber layer. And it's got metal on this side as well. And it's got the two armor this time. I don't know, maybe it could have been 9, you know, since, uh, what was his name? Hyperion's owner was always one step behind, but oh well. And we've got Tapered. I'm not gonna lie, I don't really like the Tapered disc that much. I kind of hate it. One of my least favorite discs, but, you know, that's cool. It looks like a ramen bowl. And next we've got the Explosion Driver. I'm not gonna lie, I really like this driver because of how it looks, like the, the fire spirals. Um, this would definitely make for some like cool Beyblade battles, like when it gets tipped over and it starts hitting the thing. Especially in the Thunder Edge Battle Stadium, so I'll be sure to check it out over there. And last but not least, we have Ultimate Gear Belial. We've got the Belial Lair, the new DB Core, and we've got the Ultimate Gear on it. Now, as of this video, I don't have the Versus set yet. But once I do, I'll make an unboxing video on that, and we'll finally have the perfect gear belly out that we all waited, what you, that you all waited for. So you got the ultimate gear without the stickers, the DB core, and the layer, and whatever disc this is. Yeah, so it turns out it's called the one gear. I thought it was a six armor. And as you can see, the D, the the burst lock changed to red. Before it was white. I wonder why. And next, you've got the traditional. We all know it. The Nexus disc, Belio's iconic disc. We've got bearing dash or bearing driver, bearing drive. Yeah, I think that's what it's called. I'll just edit. Yeah, bearing driver, uh, bearing, bearing drift. There we go. Not, I'm not gonna lie, it looks pretty cool. We'll have to see it in action though. Reminds me of uh, Dangerous Belial's driver. 
And last, last but not least, we have the Helios MR Launcher with the red and blue. I'm not gonna lie, I'm not really a huge fan of it, but you know, it's a really good launcher. So I'll just put it together real quick. We're on the right spin. Just like your traditional DBBU launcher. Now I've got about three DB launchers in my collection. So, you know, that's pretty cool. We got the first one from Xavier Valkyrie, the one from the Overdrive set, and now the one from the DX set. So I'll put those up to the side. All right, so we got all the Beyblades out. We got Helios and Hyperion MR and Ultimate Be Be Gear Valkyrie Belial. All the parts together. Honestly, without the stickers, I'm not gonna lie, I kinda like it. But I know that once we add the stickers, it's gonna be really good. But before we do that, let's explore the main gimmicks. Starting off with Divine Belio. So we got the burst lock, a red burst lock. We got the ultimate gear and the armor underneath. We've got the Nexus disc, which can fit any gear. And we've got bearing dash and you know, that's, Nothing too special, but it's it's good. It's a good addition. Next, we got Hyperion MR. We got the Explosion Driver. Not, I'm not gonna lie. I really like this. I really like the way it looks. Tapered, eh, meh, eh. And obviously now we have the Hyperion MR layer. And now we're gonna do what anyone would do once they buy this set and disassemble it. So let's get on with it. So, what you gotta do, you take out the DB core, you take out the armor, and then slide it upwards like that. Nothing too hard, nothing too simple. Be aware not to add too much force to it though. Now, my recommendation for if you're for the first time you're getting this set is to not use the fusion gimmick too much because then it'll become loose and basically break apart easier. So, just to save yourself a bit of bucks, I wouldn't rather, I wouldn't really do this gimmick as much. So, you know, you've got the MR blades and the Hyperion DB core. And essentially you could do the same thing for the Helios uh, driver as well. So once again, slide it upwards. There. Oh shoot. Camera. Just like that. Take it apart and you slide it back in. Now, the neat part, as you guys can see on the boxes, let me just move these guys out of the way. And you too. You can interchange these wires anytime, any way you want. So you got one way like this and the other way like this now do be careful though because you know once again I wouldn't recommend doing this a lot but that's up to you it's a really cool fusion part I really like this set I really like how they both fuse with each other it would have been really nice to see this in the anime but unfortunately Beyblade X is here, so as I'm recording this, there are a lot of people doing Beyblade X unboxings, which I will be doing soon, but yeah, very soon. All right, now that we got this all of, out of the way, let's assemble them. All right, now the Beyblades are finally assembled. Hyperion MR, Divine Belial, and Helios MR. We've got Giga, or whatever the driver is. We've got the explosion driver and tapered and everything. Now, now that everything is all set, let's add the stickers. The Beyblades with the stickers on. Helios, I mean Hyperion MR, Helios MR, and Divine Belio. Now that that's out of the way, let's do a test battle. All right.
Well guys, that is it for the Ultimate DX set unboxing. Let me know your thoughts in the comments and I really hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, I really like the fusion gimmick and I'm really excited um, that I got this. So, you know, if you're ever thinking of picking this up, go for it. I'll leave a link below to where I got it from so you could grab it too. And yeah, Beyblade Burst forever. Bye-bye. Subscribe.